small manufacturing city in the Rust Belt of America where the hunter becomes the hunted. New ways to pick your perfect look for the battlegrounds, customization for team deathmatch kits, and more. This is the PUBG Season 10 Patch Report. Nestled in blue collar North America lies Haven. Once an industrial capital, Haven fell on hard times as manufacturing jobs left the country to the lowest bidder. Now, Haven is under the control of a mysterious company and their hired mercenary organization, Pillar. Haven is a compact one-by-one -one map with a maximum of 32 players. Unlike any map before, it focuses on small-scale urban combat, stealth, and tactical gameplay. To achieve victory, you'll need to avoid detection and strike at Pillar's guarded caches to gear up and take down the remaining players on the map. Staying hidden is easier said than done, with Pillar's scout helicopter spotting threats and calling in the heavily armed tactical truck to shoot them down in a fiery barrage. Luckily, you'll have the new emergency parachute to utilize to make navigating the city quickly that much easier. Players who make it past the helicopter spotlight can target and take down Pillar commanders, who guard loot caches full of powerful gear. Beware, Pillar guards are heavily armored soldiers and should be handled with caution. Do you have what it takes to eliminate both Pillar and your competition? Preset looks are also coming to the Battlegrounds in Update 10.1. Now you can utilize rented slots to store complete costumes and easily switch between your favorite looks without having to dig through your inventory for each piece. Simply unlock a preset slot and set your favorite costume to it for easy access in the future. And speaking of customization, you can now set up your own custom kit for Team Deathmatch. Players will now be able to set up a maximum of five custom kits to use in Team Deathmatch. So outfit your favorite loadout and see how well you can do with it. A few more quick updates include adjustments to rank point calculations and an enhanced penalty system in competitive play. And last but not least, the ability to play emotes while waiting in the lobby for the game to begin. Now you can synchronize that good luck dance before every match. Finally, there's a brand new Survivor Pass full of awesome new looks to immerse you in the story of the island. Grab awesome new skins, emotes, and some G-Coin to spend by completing the pass as you fight your way through the mean streets of Haven. There's plenty more detail we couldn't go into here, so make sure you check out the patch notes for everything new. Season 10 is here and waiting for you to show what you're made of. So pull that emergency chute and avoid the kill trucks as you hide, seek, and survive the streets of Haven.